Hello everybody, welcome to Daily Entomologist uh, out collecting today. Uh, instead of like a video of like everything collecting, uh, this one's just going to focus on dragonflies and damselflies. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous for a hike right now, although maybe a little too cool and no sun. It's overcast. Uh, but hopefully as it warms up throughout the day I'll be able to find some stuff um, at about a collecting about 6,000 feet in northern Colorado so uh, hope you uh, enjoy the video hope we find some cool odinates and uh, like and subscribe and if you uh, see something you really like, comment below and tell me your favorite species of dragonfly and damselfly that either you have or you saw in the video. Uh, so let's get this uh, collecting trip underway. Alright guys, finally found our first out on eight. It's been extremely slow so far. Very few insects at all flying. Oh, okay. He's kind of flew up. Let's see if I can find it on the camera. There it is, yeah. So I'm gonna try catching it. Hopefully get a closer look. It looks like a female. Hoping it's a male though, because those are much easier to ID. Alright, got it. Let's see what we got. So, it is a female. I don't know if it shows up on the camera well, but you can see the... Let's see if it'll focus. You can see the ovipositor right there. Quite drab coloration. Uh, it looks like a species of dancer what species I am unsure But I'm gonna throw it in an envelope for now. Hopefully, I can find some males around. To help me get an idea of what species it is. Um, but hold on a second, and I'll throw it in. Uh, throw it in an envelope. All right, so I got it in the envelope. This little glassine trying paper triangle that I made last night you know just regular wax paper and these work fantastic for 
dragonflies and dandelflies, even butterflies. Um, so, yeah. This will help protect it, uh, keep it alive, and not let it get smushed. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to put it in that container so it's nice and safe. And hopefully we'll go find some more stuff. Alright, so just down the trail a little bit from the first one. It's still right next to our creek. Sun finally peeped out and we have blue sky. And... And another damselfly. Well, here goes nothing. Ooh. Completely missed that. Alright, so that last one I tried to take a swing at. I completely lost. Uh, but right here... Got another one, and this one looks like a male, and that's fantastic because I want males. So, hopefully, this one will go a little smoother than the last one. And I got it. All right, I'll get this out of the net and show you guys. So, got it out. See, beautiful blue, blue face, blue eyes, blue legs. Definitely a male. So, definitely be keeping this one. Uh, still looks like I can still dance her. Uh, possibly a vivid dancer. I can't be certain until I actually look at the, uh, uh, the genitalia. Look at the, uh, paraprox and the Circe. But, uh, yeah. Fantastic find. I'll get that in the envelope and continue on. All right, so I got that one situated and literally about 20 feet up. A couple more damselflies. Looks like we got a female right there. And uh, looks like another male right there. So I'm going to go ahead and catch it. Or try to catch it. Ooh. Okay. Didn't go very far. Missed it again. Somewhere. Oh, there it is. Sweet, got it. All right, I think this this looks like the yeah, it looks like the same species. So be really nothing new. So I'm gonna get that in the envelope and keep on going. See if we can find some more. All right, well, sun's gone away. It's actually just started raining. And uh, so, 
I'm actually about to call it a day, unfortunately. But, that'll damplify there. Get under this tree. Literally, right when it started raining, saw, seen a couple dragonflies, but never been able to catch one today. Till right now, very last one. It was actually just chilling, hanging down from that uh, cedar right there. So, kind of under a, under a tree right now. Let's take this dragonfly out. And I have actually haven't really been, I haven't gone dragonfly, damselfly collecting at all since I moved out to Colorado. So I'm not familiar with most of the species. Unless they're like the common ones I've seen back home out east. Oh, beautiful. She's gorgeous. Female. Uh, some species, uh, species of uh, darner. And, uh, yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Uh, I've never actually held this species in hand before, so I'm not sure what it is. I'll be able to find out later. But uh, all the damselflies I caught today and seen today all seem to be vivid dancers, um, all the same species. And I was actually able to catch two males, a uh, brown colored female and a blue colored female. So that actually ended up turning out pretty good for that. I got the whole color range right there. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to get this gorgeous one in an uh, envelope. And it's raining, so probably call it a day after this one. So thanks for watching. Um, it's a really short video uh, compared to my other collecting videos. Uh, and kind of a disappointing day all, all around. Uh, so hopefully this week I can, I'll get back out and be able to get some more to show you guys. Uh, so uh, thanks for watching, um, and I'll see you guys next time.